How's it going everyone? In this video, we're gonna go over solo. The stock has been breaking out to the upside. We talked about it a few days ago and the stock is continuously going to the upside. We're gonna go over exactly the investor presentation for this specific company. So this, we're gonna go over exactly, you know, what is the market that this company is trying to go and expand on and sell their vehicles on. We're gonna go over exactly their, their projections and what are they looking forward and the future we also going to be looking at some of the partnership they're working with and if you're somebody that wants to get involved in this company for the long term it's going to be video that you want to be watching out for because there's a lot of important information that was laid out in this inventor investor presentation so make sure you stay tuned and later on also we're going to go over the short-term volatility that's happening in this specific stock and we're going to go over if it's a good opportunity to get involved in it or not so make sure you stay tuned now let's get right into the video now let's go into the presentation so straight from the bat you know they talk about exactly the share outstanding they have which is 33.3 million and fully diluted share outstanding is 58.7 million the insider holdings is 36.3 percent you know that's a lot that is really great to see you know the ceos the employees the cfos and all these people are going to be holding the company shares that is really good to see and their headquarters it is based upon canada and they have right now 63 employees and these are the corporate technology partners they have over there so what they're battling what they're trying to attack right now is the growing ev market and they want to take a piece of the market share over there so just to lay down the exact amount of people that are buying electric vehicles just in the u.s there have been 840,000 evs on the road in 2019 and also in 2018 sales are continuing the historical momentum for q1 2018 sales increased 32 percent as compared to 20 q1 2017 so the main thing when you look at these electric vehicle companies of course is going to be the battery cost you know that's what they are saying right now because it costs a lot of money but right now they are working to reduce the cost and you know tesla is also the major ev company right now that is trying to come back and come up with their own bad battery technology to reduce battery costs you know this this company is also is trying to reduce that and the battery costs are actually dropping so when that drops you know these vehicles are definitely going to be more cheaper more affordable so later on we're going to see exactly how much you know solo cost compared to all the other electric vehicle companies available so and also this company also bought the italian inter mechanica company just to use them for production now this company has been around since uh, 90 for 60 years and they have a lot of experience also that's why they got them so the solo this is the main car that you're going to be able to buy right now at this current moment do a pre-order and you'll be able to schedule if you're interested in buying it it's a hundred percent clean energy eliminates fossil fuel which is important that's why you know california wants to eliminate fossil fuels so that they can protect the environment over there in california so this is a one person vehicle and as you can see it's three wheels and the retail price currently is fifteen thousand five hundred dollars the least expensive ev in the entire market in the united states you know so and the range is also a superior range which is 100 miles so it can go up to 100 miles that is really fantastic so this is also another vehicle they have over here which is the tofion which is the evolution of intermechanica it's 100 percent clean energy eliminates fossil fuel two percent sports car and also retail approximately fifty thousand dollars or electric sports car industry leading range of 200 and 50 miles you know so that's really great the design actually looks better compared to the three wheel i personally like this one better than the three wheel vehicle but you let me know in the comment section below what you think about it so it's high performance electric driven car 150 miles top speed zero to 60 in five seconds lightweight hard stop and also limits delivery date by 2020 so that's really great and also when you look at compared to the solo which is the three wheel car compared to all of the other available electric vehicle companies this is the exact price range so when you look at the price for the amv solo costs fifteen thousand five hundred. the smart electric car costs twenty eight thousand seven hundred and fifty. the tesla model 3 cost thirty five thousand. you know the chevy the nissan they're you know they're above thirty thousand and close to thirty thousand. so the electric one mile is going to be for up to 100 miles up to 76 miles up to 220 miles up to 238 and up to 150 miles so you know it's really not that bad because you're getting 100 miles it's right in between so that is really great and also the top speed is 85 83 130 for tesla model 3 the tesla model 3 is the leader one over here and the remaining ones are below 100 and our Komodo is at 85.85 miles per hour so the full charge time is also this is really interesting because the charge time is really really 
fast, which is three hours on a 240 volt outlet, and that's going to be for three hours on a 240 outlet. And the Tesla Model 3 is going to take 11 hours, so that's a that's pretty big on a 204 volt outlet. Nine hours on a 240 outlet. So when you look at it, the other close competitors than Nissan Leaf, so this is going to be the one that is going to be relatively close, but you can really charge it super quick at three hours you know so the vehicle class is going to be micro the other ones are subcompact compact subcompact compact you know so now let's move on to the pre-orders and some of the things that they have planned for the future so these are the total orders that i have right now pre-orders and units so that is really great so there you can see there's a demand for this specific vehicle and the charge and ready to roll as you can you can actually see you can have on top of the car your serving port and anything like that that you want to have on top of it so the other thing that you want to see, look at it, of course, at the back, there is a room for it where you can, you know, put your stuff. You can definitely use it for delivery. I know in the previous video, you know, somebody mentioned that you can definitely use this car for pizza delivery because that is really one of the alternative. If you're a pizza delivery guy, this is going to be the one that you can use, you know. So, so for California as the one that is buying, you know, this electric vehicle cars over there, as you can see over here, the population of California is 39.5 million. And you know the cars sold over the majority of the time is go over there. So as you can see in the U.S., 193,000 EV sales in 2017. You know, like more than half of that has been sold in California for 2017 data. So that is really interesting to see. That's why they're targeting over there in California first, and that's what they're doing. So scalable sales and service models. So this is direct sales that you have if you want to buy the Solo, accepting all my reservations with a refundable deposit of 250 Canadian dollars for the Solo and a thousand dollars for the sports car. You know, so that is one of the thing you want to do. And also they have dealership over there in California if you want to get this vehicle. You know, so the service is also is to be serviced at both corporate and independent dealers. So you can get your service if you have some issues with this vehicle you can go go to the deal and get at that so the contact manufacturing models over here is that the scalability this is how they produce it over here and uh, this is exactly how they manufacture the vehicles look at the model over here and that's what they're doing over there so they have six pending patents the battery cartridge solo swing arm vehicle design solo additional patents they have like well really relatively good patents that are pending right now you know these are some of the things that they're filing out to get the patent for their vehicle so when you look at the team over here they have jerry which is going to be the ceo henry is going to be the founder and the president and we have isaac which is the chief administrative officer and this lady is also going to be the chief financial officer of bal and ed is going to be the general manager so and also in this presentation they go over in detail exactly you know some of the prices and some of the latest technologies when it comes to their to specific technology and that is one of the important things you want to be looking out for if you want to get involved in it. So the growth trends for this specific industry in California, that's going to be the main one. And when you look at exactly the potential candidates, you know, some of the designs they have over here, which is the Cargo, the Solo Twin, and the Super Solo. So this is the designs they have for the future. So we'll see exactly if they're going to be implementing this in the next coming years. And this is going to be the outline for this company, the gas versus electric range. And this is the amount of money that you can be saving when it comes to uh, the sales and gas, which is relatively pretty good. So now let's look at exactly, you know, why the stock price has been super volatile. You know, the pre-market today, it opened it significantly higher. You know, throughout the day, it hit a high of $13. And right now, it's getting closer to $13 and made a new 52-week high, of course, at $13.60. You know, a few days ago, we talked about exactly, you know, what, potential, what is the potential of the company because it was broke out of the $6 area. Right now, a double basically 100% to uh, $12. So it even way above that. It went above to, you know, 110, 115%. So when you look at exactly if you want to get involved in it for the long term, of course, you know, so you can definitely scale into the position as we talked about it. If you want to be a long term investor, you have to be super, you know, do more research about it, understand, you know, there's some of the risk when it comes to long term investing in the stock. You can definitely pull back a little bit, but you can definitely scale into this position. You know, you can buy like one share, and if it dips all the way down to like $6 to $10, you can buy more, but you have to see the long term. You know, if you believe in the design of the vehicle, if they're going to be able to sell this vehicle in California, if there's going to be market for it, you have to take into consideration that. But in this video, I just covered exactly you know what is the potential for this company. If you see that the information that was presented by the the investor presentation for this company is is convincing enough for you to invest, you know, so of course, do more research about it. You know, there's been a lot of you know, investors that are getting involved in these EV companies, like all of them have been going up, you know, 10, 20, 100% within a matter of days, you know, so Solo's 
one of them. So make sure you do more research about it. But in the short term, if you want somebody that went to string traded or day traded, you know, the volatility is definitely right there. You know, even if you bought it when we were talking about it right around right around over here, you know, the stock broke out to the upside, you could have made, you know, 15, 20, 30 percent within a matter of days. So if you're day trader, swing trader, this is the stock you want to be watching, trading at this current moment right now. So let me know in the comment section below if you're somebody that wants to be investing it or trading it, getting in and out, you know, making 10, 20, 30 percent. You know, I've seen people make a lot of money with this with this stock, you know, so let me know in the comment section below. And if you have any questions, any comments, you know, drop in the comments and I catch you in another video. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit the like button and have a wonderful day. Mm -hmm.